It's a rainbow island with a bird. I'm reminded of Donkey Kong. Apparently, our hero is Moses. Moses of the... Like... Of those... Well... He's a very loud Moses. I don't know what I'm trying to say. They look like those... Things from trees. Chestnuts. I think. Whatever. I don't know what I'm watching. Still less confusing intro than Spiral Dragon. Well, that guy looks bad. He also looks like he's made of, like, Legos. Or those Lego knockoff things. He has laser eyes. That's fascinating. Is he leaving? Is he running away? He's not helping, he's running away? That is fantastic. Our hero, everybody. I don't know what anything in is in this game. Hey there! Ultimate Yoshi here, and welcome to my new Let's Play of Croc, Legend of the Gabos. Um, this is blind. This is a platformer. Um, I do not think this is gonna be good. <laughs> As in, like, I don't think my this playlist is gonna- this play is gonna be good. I, like, clueless as to what this game is, other than the fact that it's a platformer. So, and I, like, this is, I don't really know how to even talk about this game. Like, yeah. Alright. Um. Whoa. This controls really weirdly. Um, this is a game that is, was released on the PlayStation 1. Whoa. Okay. I don't know what I'm doing, is the point that I want to stress here. I am incredibly, incredibly unfamiliar with this game. The only thing I know about this game is that apparently it was, it was meant to originally be a Yoshi game, but then Nintendo didn't want the IP to be released like that. And I guess I'm collecting these jewels. I don't really know. Like... I, I, I don't know, how, how do I even talk? How do, how do I words right now? Yeah. The, fu the funny thing about this game is, for me, is that I've been waiting to let's play this game for a long time now, because I want, as like most of the PlayStation 1 games, well, all the PlayStation 1 games I played, I borrowed this from my cousin. The cousin who I borrowed Spyro 1, 2, 3, and Rayman from. I played all those games on my channel. Rayman was only just in a live stream that I uploaded the highlights to. But, I played all those games and I was like, I'm gonna play this one because this one looks fun and it's pla apparently a platform that stars a crocodile. And it's like, I, I, love, I love platformers and I love... Ow. All my stuff. I want my stuff. Oh, so these are like... I think they're rings. I think they're like Sonic rings. <laughs> I think that's what those are. Huh. Can I double jump? Well... Wow, that's... That enemy did not stay dead for long. How do I... I have an about face button? Okay. And I have a settle button. 
camera control buttons. How do I double jump, though? How do I get up there? Can I just, like, jump up there? I guess I can jump up- just jump up there. This world looks really empty. I don't know what I'm talking about. This is probably gonna be the worst let's play I've ever done. <laughs> but, I mean, I'm in, I'm kind of enjoying this game so far. Blech. Ow. Yeah, these are totally rings. That's interesting. Apparently I'm also collecting like... I mean, this is why they include an about face button. It's so hard to maneuver. I think I'm collecting like these... The little chestnut guys are, like, are the gobos. I know that. And this is their legend of them. I, um, in the cutscene originally, that the king guy hit that gong, and a bird showed up. So I'm gonna assume that's the end of the level right there. But I wanna explore more because there's more to explore. Ooh, okay, you're a guy. Okay, that okay. I will accept whatever the hell just happened. Uh, mm, mm, mm. this is very eh, awkward, but I mean, I don't know. Ow. Alright. How do I do? Aha! I don't know what I did differently that time, but I'll accept it. Ah! Not allowed to do that, you jerks. Ah, this is so weird to play. I sure hope I don't die. I don't know what's in here. At all. Anything could be in here. Jello is in here, apparently. And a key? I got a key? Was there a key up there that I didn't see? I don't know. I'm very confused. Is that a balloon? What? Okay, so I held the button and that cancelled the balloon. Did I get everything in this level? I can't even tell. This is such a weird experience for me right now. But whatever. Yay! I don't know if I did what I needed to. I don't- I'm confused. But, whatever, I guess that's what PlayStation 1 games do to me. They confuse me utterly. It's like this- Either way, I've been waiting a long time to- I started this conversation earlier, but I completely lost my train of thought because this game is so weird that it's kind of in- it requires all my concentration. Duh. I guess. Can I climb up this? Aha, I can. Uh, I was going... Way back when, when I was doing the Spyro games, I was like, Alright, I'm... I'm... I was... I got this game, I was like, I, this thing, I think this would be fun to blind let's play alongside the Spyro games. And so I, like, kind of all... Got all prepared for it. Ow! You have a projectile. I was just gonna leave you be. But no, you had to do that. Um, so I w what I was gonna do was I was gonna let's play this game alongside Spyro 2, which was way while ago. That was good grammar. Either way, it was a long time ago. So with Spyro 2, like I wanted to do this game alongside it, but what changed? Well, I just kind of like. I don't specifically remember, but I, I instead I just did Cave Story instead of this, and I was like, alright, I'll do this a different time. And there have been other times when I've been like, maybe it's time to do this game, and then I just kind of didn't. I just kind of didn't do this game. That was brilliant. Splat! I like this guy's voice. Croc is silly. About face. 
That's actually a kind of useful button. What I don't like is how the enemies respond like that. Alright, I'm out of here. I don't trust myself with this game right now. What the heck? Where the hell am I? I guess I did fall into this place. I can't see anything. Well, there's a trapped gobbo in there. This is a really silly game. But I don't know, I'm enjoying it so far, I and mean, this is just the first episode, so I'm sure this let's I'm sure if you think this all let's play is really awkward right now, just just give it another chance because I am like I think I'm kind of bad with with my first impression with games sometimes. Sometimes I just Sometimes I just have a hard time getting used to stuff like I mean Spyro a hero's tale like that's all the Spyro games really but Hero's Tale especially kind of just gave me a lot of like trouble at first cuz I was like just focusing so much on the differences I didn't even ugh. Didn't, didn't come out well the first few episodes, I feel. But this, I don't, I don't, this is kind of like the same way. But I'm, I'm hopeful about this Let's Play. And if not, well... I mean, I, at least I can say I finally did it. No, oh, I got the green one. I don't really know what these little gems are, but they kind of remind me of, like, fake disco balls. We're gonna make Croc have a rave. Mm. This is... It's like slightly tank controlling. I don't know, it's weird. I'm not gonna get that one in the middle. About face. That is really actually useful with how, like, awkward the controls can be in this game. Like, it's like they knew how weird it was, so they're like, Alright, let's give the guy- the players an opportunity to just turn around. It would have been helpful if Mario 64 had that, actually, thinking about it. Um... It's also kind of an easy way to... Oh, I see. I see what I want to do here. Alright. Yep. I like his backing up. It's, it's, this is just an amusing game to me, so far. Boom! Oh, I, I can't just break them all? I can break them all, I just need to hold the button. Nice. Alright. That's two levels done. I don't know if I got all the gobbles, because I only got five, and it doesn't tell me how many are in the thing. I don't know. It says I got level complete. But other than that, it says nothing. Shouting lava, lava, lava! This sounds like a safe level. Level 3, shouting lava, lava, lava. Perfectly safe. There's no issue here whatsoever. Well, they certainly didn't lie about how much lava was in this level. This reminds me of, like, old PC games, I guess. I never even really played many old PC games, but, I mean, that's just what I'm kind of reminded by in concept of this game. Ow. Huh. So it seems sometimes those collectible jewels are just in the f can be like these ones, or at least have the appearance of them. I got a number. These look like giant eggs. Yeah. Ooh, switches. I don't know. What do you guys think of this game so far? I'm certainly not doing a very good job of talking over it. It's enjoyable, though. I'll give it that much. I feel like this is kind of, Maybe I should have... Act Ooh. I know what this is gonna be. It's, it's still in the middle. Alright. So, um... I feel like maybe I should have played this game on my own time and then done a let's play of it. Because with how I'm talking right now, I feel like it would this would have gotten better if I know what I'm doing. But I'm still making a deep, good pace so far, I think. Do I... What do I... Hmm. Mm. Yeah. Hmm. I, 
I don't know what this box is supposed to do. Like, it has arrows on it, so I was like, do we need to push it or something? What? Mm, okay. Let's try that again. Oh, the platform goes up. Why do I never notice when platforms do this? God damn it. I feel like you should be able to, like, swing your backpack to do an attack or something. Why does he, what is he, what, why does he even have a backpack? What is, what is it for? I don't know, but there's a gobble here. Croc could grab onto ledges in his first game. Beat that, Spyro. Uh, um, was there a thing that I could use this key for up here? I'm, I don't know. I got the key and I know that, but I don't know if I can use it yet. Uh, I can. I was like, I feel like there was something in here. Why is there a balloon here? I wonder if that's going to take me up or if it's going to take me down. I don't know. We'll find out. After I climb a box of question mark staircases. Hi. Don't mind me. There's a jello. Can I do this on the jello? I missed one of the boxes, but I hope there was nothing in it. So I hope there was nothing in it. But it seems like these are just like the rings things. This game is like a weird amalgamation of of like Mario. Sonic, and something else. Yeah, that just brings you down. What the hell is the point of that? Is there, Unless there's fall damage in this game. Which there might be, actually. There's fall damage in, damage in Mario. Huh. Guess there's another key somewhere. What the hell did that do? Oh. I am, like, blind to platforms appearing sometimes. Well, I did this, but I didn't get all the gabos. Unless there's a key in here. I don't know. Oh, there's a key behind the exit! Ha 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 Alright. Let's go free the gabo. I just disintegrate the cage. Poof. Yeah. Yeah. This is fun so far. Like, I'm enjoying this. I hope the Let's Play is gonna turn out alright because, like, I mean, I, I guess if I'm enjoying it, then it's gonna be decent no matter what, but. What? Oh, I get it. What is the point of this? What am I gonna get from this? This is kind of fun though, I won't deny- I won't deny. I got a gobble from that! Sweet! That was totally random, but whatever. Those poor sheep! What did they do? I don't know. Either way, I... <laughs> what the heck is this game that I'm playing? Lair of the Feeble? Is it the boss? I don't... I mean, I guess it might be a boss. It's a banana! Thing. I don't know what else that would be. And now it's a Sneech. <laughs> it's a Sneech. Why am I gonna be fighting a Sneech? Okay. I mean, he has the star on his belly and everything. He's a Sneech. Ooh. Ooh, okay. Not what I was expecting from that platform. I was expecting it to tilt, actually. But no, it just kind of goes in the direction you face. I don't know if there's gonna be gobbos in this thing or not. I think this is just like a walk to a boss door and you just kind of get stuff. I don't know. Yeah, I saw that platform was gonna crack. Yeah. 
That was fun. Okay. This is kind of like a cramped game, thinking about it, like... Yeah. Like, there's a lot of tight corridors. It's not like an open exploration thing like Spyro or Mario. It is kind of like... Like I said, it's kind of like a combination of Sonic and Mario 3D. It's Sneech! I'm gonna hit you. I kind of went through you. I... This is the weirdest boss fight I think I've ever experienced. How did he hit me there? I need to wait for him to stand still, I think. Yeah. This is not boss music, by the way. I... Okay! Okay! I will accept that. And now he's a banana again. Okay. Weirdest game I think I've ever played? Weirdest game I think I've ever played. That's not even the end of World 1. Okay, I guess it does say B B1. Well. <laughs> um. You know, let's see you guys next time for more Legend Croc Gallo thing. What the heck is this game and why am I playing it? I don't know, but I'm having fun. <laughs>